Welcome to this screencast. We are looking at how to convert this analog sound wave into a digital signal, which will be made of zero and ones. So in your uh, GCSE exam, to answer a question like this, you need to remember that the horizontal axis is time. And you're going to measure your, the amplitudes of your sound wave. So at set intervals, you're going to take a sample of how, what is the amplitude of the analog sound wave at that moment in time. And then you repeat, taking another sample and another sample. These samples are going to be passed to your analog to digital converter. So the smallest value possible will be zero. And the maximum value that the microphone can record, you need to set that to the maximum uh, value that your analog to digital converter can take. And that will depend on how many bits it's got. So in the case of an 8-bit ADC, the maximum value will be 255. So you take your measurements at these different moments in times, and then what you will get for sample one, so you'll get eight bits, so that value there is about the middle, so something like that. And then you will get the second sample will be the next eight bit for this value here, and so on. And each sample will be put in the order in which they've been taken in, uh, in your time scale. One more thing to remember is that, so this horizontal axis, this is time. So how there might be one millisecond here in between each sample. And sometimes, so if you take the inverse of that measurement, that will give you a frequency at which the samples are taken. Thank you for listening to this screencast, and I look forward to reading your answers in the next test.